congrats on a big win on Wednesday night. Um, your team has now scored multiple goals in four straight games, two of the last three wins. Do you feel like this group is turning a corner uh, and, and getting back to your best, as you've said in the past? I would say so. It's uh, very evident that uh, we are improving not just uh, in terms to the goals, but the collective is, is improving a lot and the way we do uh, our sequencing and the way we defending. There's something that we need to keep insisting and, and be better at. Uh, definitely we have uh, focused a lot on how can we defend uh, much better. But uh, not forgetting that you're not going to win the games if you don't score goals. That is something that uh, that assignment at the point we are we are way better and looking more like us. How important is it to have Will Cartagena back for that defensive solidity, just to have that extra mm -hmm. stopper in, in midfield there? It is very important. Uh, Will there know the role? Uh, he's an expertise in that position. Uh, I think the combination that he has done with Cesar during the years as well, that just gives them more confidence. Uh, saying this without just value, all the effort that the boys have done there, uh, the other ones that played out of their position in terms to uh, cover those, those spots and, and um, and they, they have to do a good job, but that obviously with uh, Wilder, it feels more natural. Um, what have you seen from Martin Ojeda the last couple of games, giving mm -hmm. him some starts uh, at, at that kind of number 10, nine and a half position that you mm -hmm. have in there? Right, it's, it's, uh, it's good, it's healthy for us to see Martin scoring. It's healthy for us to see him with that energy. I think he brings the, an element that for us uh, uh, is important in the collective is that his heart and his discipline and and uh, uh, the movement that he has in front of uh, the back lines is is definitely something that we use a lot. So I'm glad to see him uh, just getting this rhythm. It's, it's, it's in a good timing for the team. What's the game plan against a guy like Benteke who, who is so good in the air? Right. It's what it is. Uh, he has that quality. Uh, we will prepare him the best we can. First, it's recognize what are the strengths that they have, and this is one of them. Uh, just trying to be sharp, just conscious, and be informed about what is those things that we need to move and and how can we avoid that too. Is uh, not just that final uh, phase of that play, just marking him, but probably just avoiding to get there. And, and that's that's what we're trying to do. Uh, the, the club will honor Kaká as its first legend. Uh, it's the Legends Terrace uh, after the game. Mm -hmm. uh, how in excited are you to see him get that honor? And, and what does it mean to be representing the club uh, on that night? No, it is an incredible opportunity for all of us uh, to share with uh, Kaká this important for moment for the club. Uh, I think he's a uh, well-deserved and a fantastic human being and, and, and a fantastic footballer uh, that represents the colors of a club that is young. And he being the first is, is fantastic. Uh, so to Kaká from all of us, players and coaches, our respect and admiration and uh, it's well-deserved what is going to happen. So I'm glad to see him sharing with the fans. Uh, and the fans sharing with him is 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 great.